Bud Not Buddy is a wonderful story written by Christopher Paul Curtis. It won the Newbery Honor and the Coretta Scott King Award when it first came out. It's a story about a young orphan in the Depression living in Flint, Michigan, and it's his quest to find his father. And to do that, he has a faded flyer of a jazz band, and he's sure that the man in that picture must be his father. And he goes on a long adventure to try and find out who that is. So um, it's a great story. It's been adapted into a wonderful play commissioned by the Kennedy Center. The script is by Kirsten Greenidge and a fantastic jazz score by Terrence Blanchard. When it came time to write the score for But Not Buddy, the first thing I had to realize is that I had to deal with the period of the story. It was a lot of fun to do, actually, you know, because I never got a chance to write for big band. I just never got a chance to really write this style of music, the style of jazz. The original score of this piece is really like another character in the play. And the score sometimes is at the front of the storytelling, and sometimes it's underpinning the action of the actors. So it's this wonderful give and take between the theater artists and the jazz musicians that comes together in something that's unlike anything we've produced before. At the heart of this story is a young person finding their own voice. For me, what I take away from the story is to think that there's this kid who has a burning desire to find out who he is. That desire is stronger than any fear. And to me, that's a very powerful thing. So uh, I'm very proud of this production. When people come to see it, I hope they really enjoy it because uh, I think it's educational and a lot of fun at the same time.